What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bebop back with another video. I'm so sorry for the lighting, man. But you know, we gotta rock with the yellow light because I had a little busy day. So I'm gonna move over so my background is just white. But y'all, if you can't see me well, just listen to, listen to what I'm saying. Just listen to the message I'm trying to get across. So I'm going on the Trello app, so, because I got my notes in here. And today, guess what we talk about? We talk about everybody's journey is different. Now look, y'all. Let me tell y'all something. Hold on, hold on. Let me tell y'all something. I fell victim to this, bro. I fell victim to this. I'm guilty of this. Not gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it 100. So before I give y'all the rundown of what... Before I explain this to you, I'm gonna explain how I was victim to this. Nice and concisely though. So, basically, my best friend in the whole wide world, bruh. You know, I grew up with him, he lived with us, all that. Everybody got that friend. He know who he is. I fell victim to this though. So, basically, I was on my path of being a better person. I was on my path of working, you know, I was going to college at the time before I, you know, you know. Working, going to college, I, mean, I had two jobs and I was going to college. You know, I was grinding. When I was younger though, maybe about like a year or two ago. Um, and you know, my cousin went to the military, my other cousin is in HVAC, all that. Everybody's doing something with their life and then there was my best friend. I'm not going to say his name, but those of y'all that know, know. He's still my best friend to this day. But, um... He basically was not doing what he needed to do in that way. Now, let, before I, I'm, this is not a video of him bashing. He's definitely better now. He definitely improved. He's definitely doing what he needs to do now. But this was before. Basically, he ain't had none going on. He was just uh, a, a leaf in the wind when it comes to life. He was letting life happen to him. He wasn't making life happen. He was letting life happen to him. Basically, whatever goes bad goes bad. Whatever goes good goes good. Um, he didn't have control of his life in a way, if you could say that. And me being the good friend that I am, even though I did this incorrectly, but me being the good friend that I am, you know, I'm always in the encourager. I was encouraging people before I even turned this camera on to encourage people. So my best friend, bro, I almost said his name. He, he wasn't doing nothing. And what I do, I'm like, bro, you got to get up and do something. You sitting here being lazy. You not doing nothing. You you never have money when we try to chill. You know, we, you never have money when we try to hang out. We don't mind paying for you, but you can't rely on us, you know. And if you don't have, if we don't pay for you, you don't come. You don't, you know, all this stuff. And then it's like, bro, how are you comfortable living like this? This is how I was. Now, I say this because this relates to the message that I'm trying to give across. Everybody has their own journey. I fell victim to this because I was trying to create my best friend's journey because I was on my journey, but I didn't realize that we have different journeys, bro. So one thing I did realize today as I was thinking about this is everybody's journey is different. What I'm learning now, he might learn in the next year. He might learn, learn learn in one year of what I'm learning now. He might learn in two years of what I'm learning now. What I learn next year, he might be learning right now, but we never know. Everybody's journey is different. And me, I always, you know, I always want the best for my peoples no matter what. So I will push up on them if I find myself doing something that they could be thriving in too. And it's just like, bro, every opportunity I get, I try to... Um, you know, encourage my peoples to do better. And um, like I said, I fell victim to this because I was always trying to force better on someone when their journey is different, bro. And I got to cut that out. Well, I don't do it no more. But, you know, as I grew up and I realized and I thought and I, you know, got smarter, I realized everybody's life is different. I can't be forcing stuff on people. So y'all... If you got a man, you got a girl, whoever it is, ain't nothing wrong with telling them or trying to help them be better, but don't 
try to make them do something like what I did. Just because you're learning something right now don't mean they got to learn it right now too. What you're learning right now could be what they will learn in the next year. Everybody's journey is different. Your life is your life. Their life is their life. Not everybody's life is the same. That's what I failed to realize when I was younger. But, you know, as I grew up, you know, my boy doing good now. And like I said, I mean, he doing good. He doing good. Um, I was scared for bro, but he's doing good. He's doing excellent right now. He, everybody could do better. Everybody has room for improvement, but you know, it is what it is. And then I got on a few other people of my homies, but we ain't gonna get into that. But um, my boy, I almost said his name again. He's like my brother, so I was on him extra heavy. No diddy. But it is what it is, bro. Stop forcing people to uh, go on your journey. Stop forcing people to go on your journey and go in lines with your journey because everybody got their own journey. They got their own journey they got to focus on. You got your own journey. So you going one way, if the if you going one way and you going the other way, let them go the other way. If you going up, don't scoop down to meet at the same level. If you going up, make sure they go up and meet you here. Don't go up and then your homie just sit down here and you go down to meet him at that same level. No, bro. You go up and make them meet you where you, you know, at your level. And it is what it is. You can't force somebody to do better. You can't force somebody to make their lives easier, make their lives better, do the work now so they could, um, you know, have an easier life in the future. You can't force these people to do that. And that's what I was guilty of. But now I totally understand. It's a lot of pressure. It puts a lot of pressure on these people. Don't do that, bro. Don't do that. And this is not even an encouraging video. This is like a lesson. This is a lesson. This is a video of a lesson. So everybody's journey is different. Everybody's life is different, bro. So if you one of them, because I was one of them. But if you one of them that, you know, you care about your friends a lot. But you trying to force your ways on them. Don't do that. Don't do that. And I ain't gonna lie, I did that with, uh, boy, I did that in my last relationship. I did that with my friendships. You can't be doing that, bro. And I came to realize that, yo, I was tripping. I can't do that. This is me taking accountability. It is what it is. You know, as a man, you got to take accountability. So I apologize to whoever I did that for. But, you know, it always it came out of a place of love. I want better for both of us. I want better for you and me. But I know my boy. He ain't gonna take it, you know. He don't take it like that. He take he could he could take con he could take constructive criticism. Oh my goodness! So it came out of a place of love, but like, yeah, that's my message to y'all. It's not a really it's really not um uh an encouraging video. It's just really just yo. Everybody's life is different. This is just to open your eyes, and if you are doing. What I used to do, cut it out. Don't do that, cause it ain't good for your relationship, bro. Cause like I said, everybody's life is different. Like, how would you like it if? I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna use this as an example because it happens to me, and I hate when it happens. But I got so used to it that it don't even bother me no more. And I just came to the realization that people don't understand. Um, but how would you like it if your mom was forcing you, yo, go to college, go to college, go to college. You know you want better for yourself. You know you don't want to work a nine to five. You know what you want to do. But she says, go to college, go to college. You're going to be working this for the rest of your life if you don't go to college. Bro, you hate that, right? You hate that. Everybody's journey is different. So if you don't want somebody to do it to you, then don't do it to others, bro. Because me personally, I do fall, I do Man, I love my mom to death. I know she would support me. I know she. this is coming from a place of love and she just wants better for me. But she just doesn't understand that YouTube is a thing. Like, I don't have to go to college to be successful. Like, it is what it is. She don't understand that. But, you know, that's all she knows. College, 9 to 5. That's all she knows. And it is what it is. I know it's not coming out of place of hate, but I don't like when people do it to me. So you can't do it to nobody. And I don't like when people do it to me. So I won't do it to nobody further on in the future because I used to do it in the past. But it is what it is. But I hope y'all got something out of this video. Like I said, this wasn't a very motivational or encouraging video. It was just a lesson, to, uh, something to tell y'all so y'all don't y'all not acting like this towards your people because... Like I said, everybody's journey is different. So I love y'all. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, comment down below what y'all want me to talk about. This percent of y'all is not subscribed, y'all. So hit that subscribe button.
And I ain't gonna lie though, before I leave, one thing I will force some, not force somebody, but I'll always get on somebody to do something, is going to the gym because you need a good body to do good things. So how you gonna do something on an unhealthy body? You really can't. But that's the only thing I'll like constantly tell somebody to do. But anyways, like I said, let's go. Turn on notifications, comment down below. I love y'all, and I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video.